the quotient rule part one, the half quotient rule. I call this the half quotient rule because it's merely one over some function. And this, of course, prime means taking the derivative of one over g of x. And the rule says this equals negative g prime over g squared. In this case, I've, I've taken a polynomial, a fourth degree polynomial, to play the role of g here. So I want the derivative of 1 over this polynomial with respect to x. So I guess what I'd want to do is put a negative in front, square the bottom, and then take this polynomial and put the derivative of, of that polynomial on top. And that's just what I do. Here it is. Notice I have a, I, this is called applying the rule. I, I square the bottom, and on top I put the same polynomial, but I put prime, which means to take the derivative. I have a negative sign in front. And of course, it's very easy to take the derivative of a polynomial. And in this last step, I do. In the uh, next uh, part two of this, we'll look at the full